Fiancé called off our wedding a week before and left me in complete confusion? Throwaway account because my ex-fiancé uses the app. So, my ex-fiancé, M30, has cancelled our, F30, wedding a week before it taking place. We've been together for about six years and lived together for context. What happened basically was an argument that escalated. We were heading to my program graduation, it's a smaller event of about 10 students and some professors from a community college, on that morning as we were getting ready, I asked if he'd would be okay to wear one of his button UPS instead of the shirt he had on so we can get a nice photo. He was annoyed and snapped saying why do I have to do things for others and I told him that he truly doesn't have to, I was just asking but it's ultimately his choice. He ended up putting the button up and we arrived at the ceremony. Everything went fine and he was very happy for me. However, on the way home in the car, traffic was filling up and he was annoyed. I offered an alternative route that I know cut some time and the exit to that route was coming up. He didn't take it and I was slightly annoyed about it because he was cranky with me about traffic. So, I asked why he didn't take it. He started full on yelling that my tone is rude and that he doesn't have to drive the way I tell him to. I replied saying that I literally just asked and I don't actually care what route he takes, he was the one having a problem with traffic. He blew up and blamed me for getting him upset. When we got home, I apologized and explained that I didn't mean to come across as mean. I also said that screaming doesn't help in any situation and that we should talk instead. He basically explained that an apology doesn't solve anything and that he needs such things to not happen otherwise he would continue exploding at me because that's the only time I listened to him. After a few hours we spoke again, he apologized for yelling and I apologized for the miscommunication that happened. Despite resolving this, later that night, I was crying due the fact that he so easily yells at me when he's upset. I was so upset that even on such an important day for me, I felt like he picked fights. And to add to this, yelling is such a red flag for me and I never do that to him or anyone for that matter. The next morning we were having breakfast and he asked why I seem gloomy so I told him that everything's okay, I'm just processing what happened yesterday. He asked me to please share with him so I told him that I felt like my special day was kind of ruined by fighting about things we could have easily resolved. He immediately just flipped and started getting angry again. He blamed me for the fights and when I replied that I don't think it's fair to blame me, he got angrier and said that he can't do this, that I'm not a good communicator and that he cannot get married like this. I was full-on shocked. I thought he was talking out of emotion, like many times before, but this time he actually ended up sending a mass text to some guests to let them know that the wedding is called off. I was flabbergasted at the quickness and so confused. We started arguing and then had to leave for our days. Later that day when we returned, I asked if this is truly something he wants, to call everything off, and he responded with a confident yes. What I thought was an action out of anger, seemed to be solid for him. For the rest of the night and the next day, I tried to fix things between us. After many hours of talking and lots of crying from my end, he kept explaining that I don't communicate well and that this cancellation my fault. I tried to offer some solutions but he was full on with the decision to cancel and break up. I asked if we could give it another day or two to ensure this is what he wants before we cancel the venue, he declined and asked to cancel the venue and vendors immediately. So we did. The next day, I went on errands and then met with my friend. It was truly such a hard day and I was heartbroken, still digesting this is happening. When I came home, he asked to talk and started crying that he regrets everything he said in the last days. That he didn't mean it, he was angry and didn't think straight. He said he will start therapy and wanted to do couples counseling now too, after I offered it many times. Anyway, he apologized profusely and kept asking if we can mend everything or whether he fugged up. I was almost sure this regret would come and honestly, maybe it was mean but I said yeah, you fugged up big time. You made a rash decision that hurt our relationship big time. There's no going back from here. He pretty much begged for another chance but everything is cancelled and my trust is shattered. The wedding's supposed to be in two days, his aunt was supposed to be on the way to our house to help us pack decorations and now, there's no way we can schedule everything again and frankly, I don't want to at this point. This is not the first he cancels plans or breaks up with me during a disagreement. Everyone is telling us that this is fixable, that clearly we love each other so if we want, this situation doesn't have to be the end of the relationship. But I don't understand how? So much time, effort, and money has gone into this wedding that's now done. And plus, more importantly, I can't trust him anymore. I don't know what to do at this point. We were supposed to go on honeymoon right after so now I'm thinking on going by myself. He asked if we can go together and spend that time to fix things but I'm just questioning everything. I think I prefer going myself to do some soul searching. Should I call this quits and move on with my life or take his word and start couples counseling? I love him with my entire heart and we had many loving experiences between us over the years. 
We don't have any issues aside from such incidents, but I don't know whether it's actually possible to come back from this one. Thoughts? Advice?